Geometry number 269, volume of a pyramid. I'm going to find out how many cubes will fit inside of a pyramid. The volume of a pyramid is one-third the volume of a prism. Because the volume of a prism, the formula is V equals BH, where B is the base, there's one here and one here, and the height, you do V equals the base times the height, then the volume of a pyramid is the volume is one-third times the base times the height. So let's work with a square pyramid. Each pyramid is named by the shape of its base. This would be a triangular pyramid. So a square pyramid is going to have a square base like this. The height of the pyramid is measured from the center of the base right here, this green line, to the vertex. Don't confuse it with slant height. That's this. That's the height of the lateral side that's completely different. It's a little bit more than the height. If this is 8, then this is probably 8.2 or something like that. So we're dealing with this height from the center of the polygon up to the vertex, okay? So I've got this pyramid right here. It's got a height of 6, and each of the base edges is 4 inches, okay? Now we could say centimeters. If you want to say centimeters, we can. It doesn't matter. It's just a, a, a unit of measure. I'm using inches because I'm in America, so, eh. All right, so if we have a regular pyramid, the first thing we do is we get the area of the base. Well, the area of a square is a side times a side, right? So if this is four, then we've got 16 square inches. There's 16 squares in here. We plug the known info into this formula, okay? So now we have the base and we have the height. We know that it's six, okay? So we say the volume is one-third of this 16 inches times the 6-inch height, okay? We do our math. One-third times 16 is 5.33. We multiply that by 6, and we get 32 inches. So, now solved, our pyramid has a volume of 32 cubic inches, or 32 inches cubed. Because remember, we're filling the volume with a bunch of little cubes, like a bunch of little sugar cubes or ice cubes, okay? Now, what if you have a triangular pyramid? We find the base measure with half base height, right? To find the, When you find, want to find the area of a triangle, you do half base height. So, if we know that each side is 4, we do 4 times 4 is 16, you divide that in half, and you get an 8-inch base. So, if our height is still 6 inches, we plug this into the formula, 1 third of the 8, is 2.66, we multiply it by the height of 6, and we get 16 cubic inches, or our volume is 16 inches cubed. Wasn't that easy? So easy to find the volume of a pyramid. And if it's a pentagonal pyramid, find the area of your base. You can split the base into triangles and figure out what the measurement of the area of the base is, and then just plug it into this formula, and you'll be okay. So, I'll see you next video. We're going to continue on talking about shapes. This is how you do the volume of a pyramid. And the next thing we're going to talk about is cylinders. All right? I'll see you there. Think of a roll of paper towel cardboard inside the roll of paper towels. That's what we're going to look at for surface and area and volume. See you there. Bye.